So it's a new week, uh, new training. Uh, unfortunately, uh, one of the bookings fell through for November for some reasons. Uh, but still got the Utah trip coming up. Looking forward to that. Uh, so right now I'm just getting ready for that. Uh, doing some training for it. And uh, of course my workouts uh, this Sunday. Because work is hectic, you know, with the lower manning that we have. Uh, I'll be training this Sunday after work again. And, uh, of course, doing my nightly workouts. Uh, got quite a bit of stuff that came in from uh, Pro Wrestling Tees. Uh, so I'm going to show you that. Uh, but for right now, yep, uh, booking fell through. It is what it is, and uh, getting ready for the uh, Utah trip. And here's what I got from Pro Wrestling Tees. So, today I just got done tanning and went and bought new wrist tape from, uh, from Walmart. Uh, so getting prepared for next weekend's show in Utah, Salt Lake City, the return to Devotion Championship Wrestling. Uh, might have some news to put out after that. Uh, some not very good news, but, uh, it's part of what's happening within my shoot life that is way beyond my control. Uh, way beyond my control. Uh. But uh, other than that, just got done tanning, just got done with the getting wrist tape. Uh, gonna do something that may prevent what I might put out after next weekend. Uh, who knows, it's something that'll definitely help push the legacy of the Irish Extreme. Uh, if it happens to work out. Uh, if not, who knows? Who knows, it still may pan out in that direction. Everything that we work for is going towards the direction that I'm gonna be shooting for. But uh, tonight will be a relaxing night. Uh, and then tomorrow, start back with the uh, weights and the uh, cardio. Uh, again, hoping to get a in the rain training session for Sunday. Hopefully it pans out whether El Conde is there or whether someone else is there to help uh, go over moves and uh, smooth things out even more. Uh, but uh, again, tonight will be a relaxing night. Uh, as you can see, I'm wearing a Pro Wrestling Tees tie-dye shirt, uh, nice shirt, and Pro Wrestling Tees hat. But uh, we'll see how it goes. Sunday hopefully getting in the rain so it's a Saturday and as you can see I'm wearing AEW gear because tonight is AEW's pay-per-view full gear uh, stacked up to be a good good pay-per-view uh, definitely something to watch and learn from uh, AEW has become the place that everybody wants to go to, everybody wants to be at here in, in the Indies. It's not necessarily WWE being the end-all be-all. Uh, AEW puts on a great show, hence why I go on the Chris Jericho cruise for a second time coming in less than a year again. Again. Uh, but uh, definitely go watch it, learn from it, uh, and enjoy it. And I'll be doing part of my workout while watching it. Uh, should be a great card. Should be a fun card. Uh, definitely looking forward. And then next weekend at this time, I'll be in uh, Salt Lake City for Devotion Championship Wrestling taping, TV taping, uh, which is huge. The, everything that they've done, everything that they've accomplished is huge, and just to be a part of it. Uh, but tonight, AEW, full gear, while working out. 
so yesterday after work came home had a couple more uh well i had another package from pro wrestling tees in the mail uh the aew hat and the fanny pack micro brawlers order that is a fanny pack that says micro brawlers and came with four mystery micro brawlers two of which i haven't had gotten yet two i have so they'll go up on sale also uh, and the uh, hat came in time to wear it while watching aew full gear last night really good show really good show it told quite a bit of story stories through some matches uh happy to see darby allen defeat cody rhodes and become the uh new tnt champion uh also uh kenny omega versus uh hangman adam page was a good match told a good story uh a little bit of uh check and see if hey man was all right after the match was uh classy told a good story uh kingston versus uh john moxley for the aew title good hardcore match for an i quit match brutal match done some crazy stuff wouldn't expect nothing else from both both people uh, but i think match of the night had to have been uh FTR defending the AEW Tag Team Titles against uh, the Young Bucks, and that match told a great, great story that uh, of the match that people have been wanting to see since 2016, since FTR became a thing back when they were the revival, after revival, uh, but with the whole. Matt injury storyline uh, then Harwood injuring his hand in the match storyline uh, it turned out to be tell the great story that ended with the Young Bucks winning the AEW tag team titles uh, it told such a great storyline that even I a wrestler cheered yes at the end of the match, got totally invested into the match. Uh, but as for today, after I get off work, I will be headed to the ring to do some training in Outlaws Rain and uh, smooth some stuff out even more before the uh, Utah trip. So uh, as I go to the ring, here's a look at what came in last night from uh, Pro Wrestling Tees. So for our merchandise, go to www.prowrestlingtees.com backslash Irish Extreme or www.prowrestlingtees.com backslash Hoodzilla Inc. And get these fabulous t-shirts.